Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Sprite One Four Five back. Welcome to Nuke Two Hundred and Forty Seven. Um, first of all, I'd like to say the Minecraft server is back and running, ish. So if anybody wants the new Hamachi details, um, long story. Um, if anybody wants the new Hamachi details, message me on YouTube. If anybody wants to join and wants the Hamachi details, the same thing really. And I get off to a shit start. Um, so I decide I'm going to snipe the old school way. Camp in a corner. But anyway, enough about that. Like I've said, Minecraft, message me, whatever. We're going to talk about my life history, for as far back as I can remember. And some of these things are actually quite touchy, very personal, but I'm, I'm going to do my best to share them. Because one of my problems is I'm an introverted person, which means I'm not very outgoing. I don't like to talk and express myself and all of that shit. I'm just not good like that. But that's me. Some people are outgoing, bubbly and all of that shit. And want to talk about everything and everything. I, I can't. It's just my nature that, you know, I can't. So, we start off year six, which is age 11. Well, I was age 11. And it's coming up to year six stats for the English people. So, your exam before you leave primary school. And my parents split up. So that's good, you know. The holidays before the most important exams of my time at that time, you've got to go through the stress of your parents splitting up and I was 11, I did not know what was going on. I genuinely was speechless. I, I didn't know what to say to anybody, I, I didn't know how to explain it to myself. My, my teachers didn't even know how to really explain it to me. So that's that. Care package on the way. Um so actually did alright in, in those exams given everything that went on, so that's a plus I guess. After that, we go into secondary school. Um still not really knowing what the fuck's going on with parents and whatnot. Um, at this point in time, I did occasionally see my mum. That should take us out every um, other weekend, every th other Thursday, I think it was. Uh, which I liked. But secondary school, I did find it very difficult fitting in, given that I'm introverted, not very outgoing, not very talkative, all of that shit. But oh well, such is life. Um, eventually, sort of made friends in secondary school and stuff, and that sort of was my friendship group. Friendship group, and wouldn't go beyond that. Year eight. So this is now twelve years of age. Um, have finally got my surname changed. Um, from Security my mum mum's surname to my dad's surname and his dad dad on his own at this time looking after us which is three of us me two younger brothers um, he didn't really know what to do with three of us either on his own I believe at this point he'd just been made redundant as well so even harder but Year 8 wasn't a very interesting year for me. I mean, 
same shit, different day. No, I'd say year nine, so. About 13, 14 years of age. Let me just work this out. You leave secondary school at 11, so year 12, year 8 is 13, so year 12, year um, 9 is 14. Okay, so I was 14. It's probably the best year I've had at primary school, well, not primary, secondary school. Um, it's sort of the year before you go into GTSEs, it was... Teachers wanted you to have fun, but wanted you to work hard at the same time. I tried my best. I sort of knuckled down, tried to get work in, you know, as you do. Trying to avoid detentions. That didn't work. I didn't find collecting detentions fun, but I, I did get a few. <laughs> and come the end of year year nine. Actually, let's backtrack a bit first. So, year eight, I said wasn't a very interesting year, but that was when I first started playing cricket and got selected for a school team. And I thoroughly enjoyed that. And cricket carried on through years nine and ten. Because year eleven, you have finished before the cricket season's really started. I didn't join a the proper outside of school club until year nine, which was a cricket club. I, I never really got into football clubs because I was prone to everything. But year nine, a, a great year. Summer, um, school trip, annual school trip was to south of France for uh, for nine days or something like that, a week and a half. It's great fun. I loved that that trip thoroughly. Probably because I actually enjoyed French at the time and the weather was beautiful. Just you're fourteen years old, south of France for a week and a half. No parents, just teachers. Triple kill. Teachers Good didn't job. really give a shit as long as you behaved. It was brilliant. And hold my hand up and say this is where I first found love um, but I, I, I was denying it to all my friends they're all like oh, you totally fancy I just ask you it's like no I don't don't lie don't lie Tom you, you do fancy her like, yeah um, it wasn't till year 10 that I actually asked her out and even then it wasn't the most romantic way of asking someone out ever but Cut fuck it, fucking such boom, is life freak bags. and I'm going to carry this commentary on um, next video I didn't realise it would take so long but we'll finish at year 10 and I'll carry on next commentary I hope you enjoyed this is about on five and I'm signing out. Enjoy your day guys.